How many XRP owners are there worldwide? I've been doing a ton of research and what I found is sure to surprise a lot of you back at home. So what is going on here? How many people own cryptocurrency and more specifically, how many people own XRP? So I started my research by going to cryptocurrency ownership data on the AAA website. And there was a study that was done very recently, which went over cryptocurrency on a global scale. And what I found was actually quite shocking. And I was very surprised by a lot of my findings. Now, number one, there are over 420 million cryptocurrency owners across the world as of 2023. And this number is actually projected to go up by more than 20% in 2024. So the growth is clearly there. The largest demographics are North America, South America, Europe, Africa, Asia, and Oceania, with Asia having more than 263 million people who have crypto as of right now. The top countries include India at about 93 million, the United States at about 48 million, and then Vietnam and Pakistan being very closely there behind at 20 and 15 million respectively. Now, in terms of the demographics, the majority of cryptocurrency owners are male. That's no surprise, but there is a surprising 37% of female crypto holders and the average annual income of crypto holders is around US $25,000, where 71% of them are actually well-educated and have a bachelor's degree and 72% are under the age of 34. Now, if we look at the ownership data, we can see that India, the largest population in the world of course has the most amount of crypto holders 1.4 billion population now this is a really important stat because india's population is growing so much every single year it recently overtook china as the most populated country in the world and is projected to have a population over 2 billion dollars or 2 billion people in our lifetime now just think about how many people in india are going to be getting into cryptocurrency because of that now overall ownership percentage in india is pretty low at 6.5 percent especially when you compare it to the likes of vietnam or philippines or even the united states which are all around 15 percent or higher now, there are a number of different countries in the world like Brazil, which also really surprised me that have a really large amount of cryptocurrency ownership over 11%. And what I'm starting to see is a lot of very developed nations are choosing to get more and more cryptocurrency every single day. And also a lot of different government systems and people that are involved in a country that frankly have you know inflated currencies like we see in South Africa or Venezuela are also going to cryptocurrency because it gives them a great way to escape their government. So no matter what demographic you're in or no matter what part of the world you're in, whether it's a poor country or a very rich country, the level of crypto adoption is really growing because it gives people an alternative over the system that they exist in, whether that's in the United States, one of the richest countries in the world, or Venezuela, one of the poorest countries in the world where their currency is worth literally nothing. Now, with all of that in mind, you know, how is XRP's growth changing over time? And is XRP actually growing? Is the amount of holders going up drastically? Is it going down? How is this changing as all these other cryptocurrencies are changing drastically? Well, there was a study done recently in 2023 for XRP where we saw XRP Ledger's market capitalization has increased by over $12 billion year to date, and it was showing a 73% growth in 2023 alone. XRP Ledger is growing substantially, and this is where a lot of the decentralized applications are being built, and this is where a lot of people in these countries, especially the poor ones, will get massive value from just having XRP. I mean, would you rather be in a country like Venezuela where your currency is devalued in 90% every single year, or just get XRP, and it, it most likely over the long term will go up in value instead of down? I mean, to me, that's an absolute no-brainer. And we can see on October 27th, 2023, data from Santiment revealed that there was 4.82 million wallet addresses that hold at least one XRP, which is equivalent to 55 cents. Now, obviously, one XRP is not a substantial amount. And 4.82 million wallets, we actually have more than that today. And I'm going to be going over that very soon just to show you guys the growth from October 2023 to today's date. Because it's actually really shocking and you guys are probably not going to believe how many wallets have been created in that time. Now, another thing I want to mention is the amount of wallets 
that are existing within XRP is not the amount of holders there are because some people like me actually have multiple different wallets. In fact, I have three XRP wallets as of right now. I know many of you guys watching this probably have a couple of wallets as well. So I'll give you guys a more accurate estimate as to how many holders there actually are for XRP because the amount of holders is not the amount of wallets there are. We can also see that XRP Ledger is making it impossible to determine precisely how many individuals own XRP as one person can control multiple wallets as said right here. But the data indicates a steady growth in XRP ownership over the last 11 years, averaging around 438,000 new addresses every year. And notably, the top 10 addresses own over 11% of the total XRP supply. So obviously, XRP is still fairly centralized because of that. The top 10 wallets having 11% of the supply, almost 1% each, is very substantial. I mean, overall, um, if you saw that anywhere else in the world, you'd be like, wow, that is a really large amount of concentration in a very small amount of people. If we, if we consider the number of XRP addresses as its population, it is roughly equivalent to the population of Kabul, Afghanistan, which is around 4.6 million. So we're literally creating a small country almost with how much XRP holders we have. Uh, it's, it's quite impressive. Now, I want to show you guys, okay, how many XRP wallets there are today, right? Because in October of 2023, we saw 4.8 million. Today, as we can see right here, the total number of XRP wallets is now sitting at 5.2 million almost. Now that's a substantial increase. We're talking about about 400,000 new wallets created in less than a year. Now that is absolutely incredible. But what's more important is where are these wallet holders in terms of their overall holdings? Now, if we look right here, we can see that the vast majority of XRP holders have between 20 to 500 XRP. But there's something really cool here. You know, there is indeed about 1.7 million holders that are between 0 to 20, most of which actually have one XRP, which is the minimum amount to keep your XRP wallet active. But there's a lot more people that are holding substantially higher amounts of XRP holdings, between 20 to 500, right? And 500 XRP to most of us watching this video is a smaller amount, but nonetheless, it's still a sizable amount of XRP for most people, especially those in Venezuela where their currency is so devalued that just having you know 100 XRP can feed their family potentially for months, right? Because it's so valuable in comparison to the currency in their countries that this is a great alternative. And this is what we're seeing. A lot of developed nations are holding a lot of cryptocurrency as we saw like Venezuela on that list that I showed you because it, unironically is a great alternative for their families. Now, obviously, if you guys really want to set yourself apart from the rest of the XRP holders, you want to be between the 500 to one, uh, 10,000 range here. We can see there's only 135,000 people there, and we can see there's a very large drop-off in XRP holders when we go up from there all the way up to the number of accounts. So overall, yeah, I mean, having between 5,000 to 10,000 XRP pretty much solidifies you guys in the rich list. Now, I really want to gather more data and I really want to understand you guys better. So what I did is I recently put out a t post on uh, X here on Twitter and I asked you guys this question. How many people on earth do you think own XRP? And if you guys have time, I want you guys to go over to my Twitter post here and just comment on it and let me know how many wallets do you guys have and how many people on earth do you think own XRP based off of the data that I showed you guys here. Now, if I were to give you guys an estimate, I would say probably on average, every single XRP holder probably has somewhere around three wallets like myself. So very simply put, we would just go ahead and we would divide the total amount of XRP holders uh, by the 5.1 million here. Now, if we divide 5.1 million by three, I mean, we're getting a decent amount of holders there. Nonetheless, we're looking at roughly, what is that, like 1.7 million uh, holders in total. Uh, but of course, that number, we don't really have an accurate way of depicting it because, I mean, we're, we're decentralized, right? We don't literally ask for everyone's ID when they set up a wallet. So we'll never know for absolute certain. But I want to know, what do you guys think? How many XRP holders on earth do you think that there are? Let me know in the comments down below and make sure to respond on my Twitter post and engage with me there. We're growing the XRP army every single day. And I think discussions like this are really interesting. If you guys think so, hit the like button, subscribe, and join my Discord community so you can be part of our amazing growing army. I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.